The first black lechon, we make it for her mother's birthday. She was really shocked. Oh my God, what happened? Like, what did you do? Wow. Yes, what did you do to the lechon? And then we just tell her that, uh, you must try it, just taste it. And when she tastes it, she will say, oh, it's not burned. It's good. <laughs> In 2021, this video of a black lechon being roasted blew up on TikTok, hitting 4.8 million plays and fetching close to 1,700 comments. And right away off the back, I noticed one other interesting thing is that you actually have chilies and bell peppers, two very non-traditional things. Yes, if you will add more spices to the food, mm -hmm. it will more yummier. Like, it will add more texture and more spices to your mouth when you eat it. Chef, tell me what this is. This is what we call albahaca. How was it? Wow, it kind of tastes like a mixture of like Thai basil, but it's also got those Italian basil vibes. It's like very floral, very fragrant, but also very restrained compared to the other stuff. Does this also help with gaminess of the pig? Yes, it can help um, to like, um, to have the bad odor. So I'm gonna just rub in, yeah? Next, we will add chilies and bell peppers. Ajinomoto. So much umami. Basil. So we're doing and spring onions. Okay. Spring onions okay. So right now, we will uh, wash it and make it dry. So that we can put the black object here. Okay. So that it will uh, make it stick. So make, we're gonna make it dry quicker. This is a secret of how we are making black lechon. So this is a squid ink. We can use squid ink or a cuttlefish ink. That's how you get your magical black, yes. shiny black glaze that I've been seeing online. All edible, all natural. Wow, check out that crazy black hue. It's insane. Oh, and very sticky. I think all is well. All is well? And uh, am, we, am I ready to start the cooking process? Yeah, sure. Wow, this is harder than roasting a standard pig because you can't even see the way the crackling reacts. It's usually the pig will go from lighter color to, to slightly a darker color, but you are flying blind here. Yes, yeah, it's really a challenge for this wow. kind of <laughs> the churn. The one we're uh, gonna see this is the time, just the time. Basically, everybody just left me here and told me that I can't stop spinning this pig. This will be a one and a half hour roast. The one hour mark is the most crucial because that's when the crackling will start to begin. Ooh. Wow, Ooh. this looks amazing, Day. You can smell the charcoal. But we'll start from this part since it's the most, uh, I mean, the crispiest part. Very, very crispy. Skin, Skin cheers. Mmm. <laughs> mm. How was it? It's so crispy. It tastes like a really good lechon. I can feel mm. all those spices have permeated. It is not salty. Mm. It is so full of umami. Did you receive any non-positive feedback when you presented the black pig to the community? At first, um, they, they really feel that like black symbolizes like a um, dark thing, like a sad thing, um, someone passed away, something like that. Why are you challenging tradition? Lechon business is really competitive, so that's why I want to make sure uh, I am different. Thank you for watching. Catch all three episodes of Southeast Asia on the Plate, where we find out more about popular food dishes in Singapore, Indonesia and the Philippines. Catch more videos on CNA Insider and remember to hit the subscribe button.